Yo everyone, this is the Welsh lad, and we got ourselves another victory in the Premier League. A 3 2 win away to the Saints. And to be honest, we didn't really start that well in the game, to be fair. And, uh. <laughs> yeah, yeah, it, 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 yeah it, I, I, I will admit, it was, it, it was a brilliant game, but like I said before, it didn't really start off that well. We were struggling in the first third of the, of the uh, game or first third of the uh, 40 of the 45 minutes we we don't know but anyway we uh we lost to a 1-0 lead uh, at the, in the first 30 minutes or so thanks to a Graziano Pella rebound of the post or keeper I really don't know but uh, Graziano Pella got the first goal for the Saints just uh, d just under 15 minutes and I was just thinking to myself is it is it going to be Eindhoven again? Is it really going to be Eindhoven? I'm just thinking, oh dear. And and, and to be honest, the things weren't really really weren't weren't, <laughs> weren't really starting at all well for us. But then, uh, uh, but then uh, I, I'm just thinking to myself, uh, can, can we really push forward and try and get a goal in? And then, but then, but then just about I say. 30, 40 minutes into the game, uh, and a nice through ball was passed in from Rojo, I believe. Yeah, Rojo towards Mata, I believe. He was just going on goal. Uh, just, uh, just unfortunately, uh, just unfortunately, he uh, tried to hit it in, but unfortunately, he passed it to Matiel, who just nicely kills it into the bottom of the net on the turn. Unbelievable. So. Uh, so at the end of the first half, it was 1-1, and Martial got his second goal in as a Manchester United player in two consecutive games. Then fireworks started to go off in the second half. Just five minutes into the second half, a lovely run from Martial nicely curls it into the bottom right-hand corner, and I'm just thinking. <sighs> This is turning into an absolute bargain now for the, for for the for the Frenchman. I'm just thinking, oh my God, I'm in heaven, I'm in heaven. And uh, and uh, and like I said before in my previous review shows, we need to do our best to look after him. Don't put as much pressure on him as much, much as we can. So uh, yeah, Martial, three goals in two games. That's good. And we're just thinking, is he going to get a hat trick? Is this gonna, will it become a first hat trick in a Manchester United shirt? Well, the third goal for United came in the game, but it wasn't for Martial. It was from Juan Mata, who wasn't really having a good season so far in the uh, in the uh, right midfield position. And uh, yeah, he he got his first goal of the season in a Manchester United shirt um, after after a shot from. I believe it's Memphis. I believe just comes off the post. Unfortunately, a lands to the feet of Matt uh, left with it into the net. It's three one, and I'm just thinking, game over. It's game over. But unfortunately, Saints did get a uh, goal back. I wasn't really watching the uh, match to be honest, because like I said, it was like I said yesterday when I was doing another video, I was going to be a little bit busy. But though, uh, Saints did manage to uh, peg a goal back to make it three two. But uh, I, I'm just wanting. Uh, I'm just thinking to myself. Okay, we need to hold on here. We need to hold on. Don't go for the draw. Just hold on. We're nearly there. Then, well, when the board came up for around five minutes, the Saints were having a chance at us. They were going for us left, right, and centre. De Gea try putting out all the stops to push uh, push them out. And uh, yeah, he he he's, he's had a good game. And. Uh, Towards the uh, towards the middle of the five minutes, Paddy McNair, who came on for one of the defenders, I, I really don't, I really wasn't looking at the substitutions to be honest. But though uh, Paddy McNair made an absolutely dangerous run, and I mean dangerous run, he tried to go forward. It's unlucky for him not to get a goal, but though he did a magnificent run. That's how that's how dangerous he can be. He's now turn, he's now a Northern Ireland international. So well done to him on there. But though. I'm just, I I I I I really like to see him get his first goal in a Manchester United shirt. I really do, but though uh, yeah, it's just unlucky for him. The um the run did manage to um get deflected out by the by uh the new keepers. It's, it's not Foster. It's uh, 
second in the building. I, I, I really don't know his name, but though, uh, but though he got to the our corner was coming in. We didn't manage to get any goals in after that. So yeah, it was finished full time, three two. An absolutely fantastic game. Didn't really start off that well, but though, uh, yeah, we, we got a goal in. So, I'm looking at our record now. Uh, six games in, four wins, one draw, and one loss. Looking, looking good so far. Looking good, but though uh, we are are behind uh, Manchester City now. We're in second place. City have lost yesterday, by the way, and um, we're now two points behind City. That's the margin gap. Two points behind City in second place, and we're just thinking, are we really going to go the whole way? Are we really going to beat City when we beat them in a Manchester derby at the end of next month? I'm just thinking, I, I, it, may, it may be possible, but uh, we, need to, we need to keep an eye out here. I mean, Chelsea may be on the comeback charge, as you may know. I'm, I'm still furious about that uh, game on uh, Saturday between uh, Chelsea and Arsenal. Why Diego Costa didn't get uh, sent off? For, uh, for pushing Koscielny and Gabriel in the face. I have no idea. <sighs> Mike Dean, sort yourself out. Anyway, um, <laughs> that's enough about Chelsea and Arsenal banter for now. I'm Manchester United fan. I, I, have, no, I have no voice in this. In, in, that, in, in that game. But anyway, <laughs> I, I really don't know. Anyway, that's my review of Manchester United versus Southampton. This has been a well shot. Thank you very much for watching. Don't forget to like this video. Subscribe if you're new around here. Don't forget to follow me on Twitter. That's where mainly the action is. And I will see you soon. Ta! -da! It's here. It's finally here at last. Oh my god. Well. When I say it's here, the web app is here. I haven't really got people to see.